Fiat Chrysler is set to cough up a lot of dough, about $650 million to be exact. This is to settle allegations of emissions cheating. And as Nick Monticelli reports, this means money back in some customers' pockets. Good morning. This is significant for FCA considering they originally thought this could go into the billions of dollars. The settlement is $650 million, although FCA will not be admitting any wrongdoing in this case, and a portion of that settlement money will be sent to the vehicle owners. Back in 2017, the EPA announced it had big problems with the 2014 through 2016 Jeep Grand Cherokee diesels and the same year Dodge Ram 1500 diesels specifically for installing and failing to disclose engine management software. The undisclosed software results in increased emissions of nitrogen oxide from the vehicles. Then the Department of Justice sued FCA, claiming it cheated on tests involving more than 100,000 of these vehicles. Early on, FCA CEO Sergio Marchioni was quick to defend the automaker. Yeah don't belong to a class of criminals. I mean, to be perfectly honest, I think we're trying to do an honest job here. And I'm, like, those of you who know me well enough realize that I don't, you know, I'm neither looking for pity nor, nor compassion. But the reality is that we're, we're not trying to break the bloody law. Despite that, FCA has now agreed to pay up $657 million to settle allegations of cheating on emissions tests. Here's how the settlement breaks down. $305 million in penalties, $72 million to state attorney generals involved in the lawsuit, and $280 million to vehicle owners. That breaks down to approximately $2,800 per owner. And again, a part of the settlement allows FCA to not admit any wrongdoing in this case. And the fix for these vehicles is simply a software change, unlike the Volkswagen case, where they needed completely new hardware. I'm Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News Today.